I love seeing you guys. Happy, yeah. healthy, looking amazing. Oh my God, look at my wife. Oh God, She's look at this. Stunning. Stop Thank it. You. Uh, congratulations, two beautiful babies. Oh, God. Yes, that right there is the biggest flex of them all, being parents. We love being, um, you know, parents of, of two young babies. I just love it. Yeah, they're doing so good, and they're playing together, and Romeo is, like, obsessed with his little oh, sister, so it's really cute. Yeah. How is the little guy dealing with now me and Bella in the house? Yeah, he's doing great. He's starting to say his, uh, his first few words. It's great. He's potty training. It's a circus in the house. Um, but he's an amazing big brother and we choke up every day he's saying new words every day and yeah. we just love being mom and dad yeah he loves helping he helps with feeding her bottles and giving her like little little binkies and stuff and he really tries to take care of her so cute. It's, it's, it's the best we are such mindful parents we really are mike you've totally come full circle in life i feel like fans just love seeing you you're gonna, you're gonna make me cry oh you're gonna make me cry. no it's true fans yeah. love seeing it and you're really inspiring to so many people that were on the journey with you yes. um what are you know. most proud of right now i don't know i don't know i am yes, most like proud of um my sobriety i'm uh, eight years sober in uh december i'm most proud of being a um a sober dad of two babies i'm most proud of being a loyal husband of five years in a happy healthy marriage to my college sweetheart and better half next to me um those things right there are something to be really proud of and i continue to um turn this 15 minutes of fame into 15 years and uh, entertain millions. It's really an amazing, heartwarming story. And I and my new nickname is the uh, publication. I just released, um, I know, it sounds so good, right? Um, I just released um, my tell-all book, which will be out in the fall. It is. It will be one of the wildest books that you guys will ever read, and they will eventually uh, adapt this for a screenplay. I, I'm, I'm thinking about who should play, myself and my wife. I, I'd have to say that, um, Miles Teller could probably play the situation, okay. and uh, Jennifer Lawrence can play my wife. Oh, wow. What do you think of that? I love that. Okay. Yeah. I'm a fan of both. Uh, yeah, so um, I, I'd like to also probably uh, do a cameo. I'll be like the gym teacher or the therapist. So, so yeah. It'd be so, so cool. Yeah. Like Adam Sandler. He always yeah. Like, yeah. yeah, it's so amazing. You guys are going to really love it. It's going to save countless lives, yeah. that book. I, I, uh, I, I detail in that book. Um, how I saved myself from addiction, you know, serenity prayer, the steps, uh, the mindset, the do's, the don'ts. So I 100% I, I this, this book will save thousands of lives, for sure. Thousands upon thousands. How does Mike inspire you? Oh my goodness. Mike inspires me in so many ways. First and foremost, just his sobriety, because really putting that first is his foundation that makes him such a great father, husband friend to everyone and then it makes him excel at his profession so just really proud of him in that way but seeing him as a dad and every morning and helping us he's a very hands-on dad and I feel really lucky to have him as my that's amazing. Yeah. Uh, Mike I have to tell you your castmates are throwing you under tonight they're oh, all man. telling me that you are the biggest Sir. Oh, stop it. Listen, we're on reality TV, and there's a phrase that they say that if you don't stir the pot, the sauce is going to burn. So somebody's got to stir the sauce, right? I mean, we've been on TV for 57 years, I mean 15 years, so uh, someone's got to keep this train running. Uh, Ron comes back for a little yes. while this season. Yes, he comes back. What, what was your take on that? Were you excited to have him back? Ron, stop. Um, no, I'm joking. Um, you know what? It was good to see Ron. He was uh, he stepped back for a few years to address his mental health struggles. And uh, for a couple years, he's been doing the right thing, and now you get to see more of him. And if someone like that continues to do uh, the right thing, you'll continue to see more of him as well. So I'm excited to, s to see his story as well. Sammy and Ron had, like, a very... Uh I don't know the word, Tumul like tumultuous, tumultuous relationship tumultuous. on reality TV. Yeah, we all watched it. So for them to come back on the same yeah, show yeah, is a big see, deal. Yeah, what do we see? Do we see them in the same scenes? What can you tell us? Well, you guys get to see them under the same roof, at the same time, at the same place, and you get to see how the group navigates that situation. I think that's all I can tell you, because uh, I don't want to tell you how the story ends, but they are under the same roof at the same time. She is aware of it, he is aware of it, and you get to see how we handle that. Okay, finally, if the kids came to you. MTV approved of that what? answer, can you smile? <laughs> 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 oh, I love it.
Um, okay, if the kids came to you in years down the line and they yeah. were like, MTV came to us, mom and dad, they yeah. want all of us, second generation, oh Jersey God. Shore, oh, wow. Giovanna, Melania, all oh, the kids, God. what would you guys think? There, yeah, there is a, about, I think, 10 or 11 kids yeah. upon everyone now. Um, I'd have to have a sit down with them. I'd have to have a sit down with the kids and, and discuss uh, the do's and the don'ts. Um, you know, and, and do as I say, not as I do conversation. Um, but I would, I would allow it. I would allow it. Cause they're, they're already filming Jersey Shore Family Vacation now as babies. You know, I think my son is verified on Instagram and has a half a million followers already. So, you know, I probably would allow it. It would be GTL, but wear sunscreen. That would be kind of your advice, right? Yes, we do, we do put sunscreen on Romeo. Uh, that, that boy's uh, skin is uh, very uh, precious, so yes. <laughs>